So I want full, full tension, almost at least 90% tension on them lats. All right, so let's go ahead and get it. Stretch. That's it, boom, right here. Right here, boom. Two more. You don't need to pull but so much on well, let's. It's all the gang to it. All about mind and muscle connection. We wanna grab these body parts, okay? I'm trying to teach you a little something today. They get these dips. Strong on the dips, okay? I want you to stretch on them dips right here. So home stretch. We up. Stretch because you want to be able to get a wide stretch on them pecs and shoulders. But squeeze. Squeeze. Squeeze almost like a fly. Because dips, they're done. But they're doing properly. There's so many different variations to a dip. Where you can hit different parts of your chest. That's why they call it the... Like, they call it the dips other than maybe the push-ups or the upper body squat. It's just, it incorporates your delts, so much of your chest and triceps. Similar to a push-up, yeah, but when you're push-ups, half your body is still touching on the ground, you know? When you're the dips, your whole body's in the air and grav gravity is pulling you down more. So of course it'll take more muscle for you to do a dip than a push-up. So that's why I favor, favor them a little bit more than push-ups. I've done me 4,000 push-ups, all that, you know, 500 push-ups in like a couple minutes. You know how it go, like the, the fitness influencers do, but as you see here, I do a lot of dips, a lot of weighted dips. That's how I know I've created this little sunken place right here because of so many different variations of dips, reps, the sets, the, the if I'm having leaning one way, leaning to the other, arm placement, straight bar dips, focus on a lot of them instead of focusing so, focusing so many different variations on pull, push ups. You know, I still do it, but you want to favor one over the other. I guarantee I will always favor dips over push ups any day.